All right, so welcome back to White House Farm. Uh, if you haven't, go ahead and check them out. Our videos that got us to this point for our AC system, from going from hard lines to flex, li flex lines, uh, to replacing our accumulator, also the uh, orifice tube in the line here. Uh, now we're ready to go ahead and vacuum down the system. We wanna get it down to about uh, 30 or 29, right around there. We wanna get it as low as possible on the gauge here. Uh, through our low pressure and uh, you're going to need an AC uh, system like this plus a vacuum pump for vacuuming it out. All you're simply going to do is you're going to use your yellow line. You're going to use the yellow line from your manifold there and you need an AC pump here. This is for the old R12, so you won't use this. This is for the R134A. And you're simply gonna connect it up on here. And hand tight, don't use any tools or anything like that. You don't need to. So we got that hand tight on there. Next, we're gonna go ahead and connect our low pressure regulator onto our accumulator where the low pressure uh, port is. There's our low pressure. We'll go ahead and take the cap off. And now we're going to push back on here and connect it onto that port. So now that we got it connected, we're going to turn this to the open position. And there's arrows on here that tell you which way to go. So this is clockwise. So now that is open. And you can see our pressure gauge there. Okay, once we have our low pressure line hooked up, we got that valve open. We got our vacuum pump here, it's connected. Also, just wanna mention, make sure you always got oil in here because these things run for a while, which we're gonna be letting this run for about a half hour or so. Um, but here's the gauges. We can go ahead and turn the pump on now. And we can go ahead and start to open this and you should see it drop. Yep, there it goes. So now we're pulling vacuum and we're pulling moisture and all that good stuff out of here that can ruin your AC system. So like I said, we're going to let this run for about a half hour or so. So we've been running this for the past half hour or so and we're right around 29, 30 inches of mercury in there. Uh, so what we're going to do, we're going to go ahead and close this. And we'll shut this off. And now we'll wait 10 minutes or so. Uh, you can wait up to a half hour if you want. And if this gauge moves, uh, then we know that we got a leak and normally it's where your repair was done. Uh, but we'll go ahead and let this sit and we'll come back and go from there. The gauge has not moved, so we are all set here. You can't say goodbye without saying goodbye to me. All right, Olaf. We'll see you on the next one. All right. Bye, Obo. Bye, guys.